Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So have you ever had a problem where there's moisture collecting on the bottom of your fridge? Well, today I'm going to show you what the most common issue is and a very quick way to fix this problem so that you don't get this random water appearing on the bottom of your fridge, kind of ruining your food. So if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest fixed tutorials. So this problem is mostly caused by a blocked outlet. So if you take all the food out of your fridge, mostly you're going to find a hole at the back like this and it basically helps to collect and pull water and it goes out of that hole and it collects at the bottom. And normally this side is the one that's blocked. It could be the bottom of the fridge at the back where there's a pipe which might be blocked as well. So I'll just zoom in a little bit more. You can see that it's gone a little bit black and there is water pulling here. And basically you want to use something like cotton bud and basically clear this channel out. So just be careful, you don't want to get the cotton part of this stuck and make the problem worse. Or can use some kind of wire which is non-metallic. I don't recommend that you use any kind of sharp metal because you probably want to turn it off before you do anything with anything that's too rigid or sharp. So anyway, we're using this cotton bud and basically going in to here and then clearing out this blockage. And uh, let me just zoom in a bit more. Yeah, we can see that there's this kind of gross bit of like crap and uh, I can see that that is probably the thing which has been blocking the hole the entire time so I'm just gonna so I'm just gonna clear that up so get rid of all this dirt and moisture on the side and uh, let me see if I can get anything else out yeah so it's probably a good idea to clean this out every now and then your fridge might come with a specific device which is designed for this particular hole. However, I find that cotton buds probably do a good enough job. So anyway, the hole doesn't have to be 100% clean. It just has to be enough for the fluid to be able to drain out properly. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. I've got lots of other videos like this on my YouTube channel. So please check out my repair videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.